Hello, this is Daryl again, and we're in Photoshop looking at some more of these tools. I'll show you some uh, things we can do with canvas and image rotation. Let's open up a photo, and we'll look at this one here. Okay, we got this deer here. Notice that the camera wasn't held straight when the photo was taken, so it looks like the deer's going downhill. Let's try and fix that by going up to image and image rotation for this. Now what things we can do, we can flip a, a canvas 180 degree, you know, they've got these different options. If you flip it horizontal, we can make the thing look like this, see? We've got this deer walking downhill this way. Uh, let's say we wanted to straighten that out. Uh, we can go to image and back to rotation and hit arbitrary. Uh, this whole picture needs to be turned around a few degrees counterclockwise. Uh, looks like more than four degrees, let's say six degrees. And turn it around counterclockwise like that. Now we'll need to recrop the photo by choosing our crop tool and we can uh, crop in on it like that but you'll notice if we crop in like that we'll go ahead and hit crop okay now we've got some uh, border here that we don't like so to fix that you can go ahead and use your uh, clone stamp or your cloning tool over here by choosing that and I've already got the sizing set here where it, it's just about right. So hit, use your Alt key and click there and go ahead and, and clone what you need to to make it look good again. And we got a little extra stick there, but we can always take it out like that. And uh, the deer steer it still isn't centered, so we can uh, crop it some more like this. And uh, go like that. Maybe scoop this down a little bit. And crop that again. So there, now we have the deer walking pretty straight. Okay, so now another thing we have here is canvas size. So we go to image and let's choose canvas size. This shows the size that the uh, photo is, but let's say we wanted to make a border, a nice border around it, maybe to add some text out in a margin or in a border. If we change the size here, um, let's add, uh, oh, let's make this uh, 26, say. We'll make it 26. And how about if we make this 21? This down here tells us do we want black, white, what color do we want our canvas extension? I'll just leave it black and hit OK. Now we have a border here around our picture. If we wanted to save it like that, we could. Um, if we wanted to make it even bigger, a wider border, then we'd have some space down here. We could choose our text key and uh, put in some text down here. And so there's a lot of tools available here and hope that some of these can be useful. And we'll see you again in another video soon.